Hey there, Lepter here, welcome back to Call of Duty Zombies. Today's challenge, we're doing a box roulette challenge on a map through Eisendrock. Now, if you're unaware what this challenge is, basically what it means is every single round, I have to hit the mystery box, get a brand new gun, and just use that gun for the whole entire round, and just, you know, rinse and repeat the process. But I do want to set a couple ground rules here. Number one, if we get, like, monkey bombs, trip mines, they will not count. They're mainly, like, tactical grenades, not actual weapons, so they're not really going to be too useful. Um, however, if I do get them, I'll grab them, but I won't use them just to get them out of the mystery box uh number two is if we can't get to the mystery box like we don't have enough points to hit it or we just can't get to it in general uh we will have the option to use a wall buy just so that way we can get like a brand new gun for that round and i'm mainly saying that for like this round because of the fact that round two we're not going to be able to hit the box speaking of the box where is it ah damn it i really hate the mule kick area but you know what I'm, I'm gonna let it be. I'm gonna let it go. I'm not gonna stress too much. Where's the zombie at? I hear him. There you are. Man, you are, you are walking everywhere. But it is now round two. Let me buy the Shiva. And then I will hit the tram. Hopefully we get double points. Or who knows, maybe we'll get the ray gun. I've only gotten it like a couple times, so probably not. But it's still wild that I even got it like once. But we got the max ammo. That's... Not exactly useful, I'll take it, but not really gonna... I mean, what more can I do with it? It's round two. Ooh, we got insta-kill. I'll use that for some points here. You know, I'll probably need to buy the RK-5, because I don't think I'll have enough to hit the box this... Mm, hang on, let me see... Uh, 750? No, definitely not. Alright, uh, let me buy the RK-5, and I'm gonna buy Quirk Revive, just in case we go down. But man, oh man, can you guys believe it? Black Ops 6 is so close to being here, like, not even three days, and I'm so excited. Like, overall, I am super excited to see, like, all the new stuff they're adding. I did hear they did change Liberty Falls a little bit, like, how it looks, so I'm intrigued to see what that looks like. Haven't really seen the images, kind of want to go in like blind for that, but I'm excited for like gobble gums, the uh, augments for the perks, uh, trying out the guns as well, that would be pretty cool. And a one weapon, it's pretty, pretty unique. I think it's like the uh, beam laser gun or something like that. I can't remember the name, but it's like a beam laser. But yeah, I'm super excited for that. I'm super excited for mainly Terminus. I still think Liberty Falls will not be like my favorite map. I think it will be more so a camo map, but that's not, that's not to say it will be bad. So, we'll kind of wait on the fence for that one. But, I think the only thing I will... Ooh, that's not really good, but I'll take it. Uh, only thing I'm not really looking forward to is going to be the shield system. Wasn't a fan of that in Cold War. Not liking how they're doing it for this, uh, this game. But, we'll see. Maybe I'll like it. I was a bit harsh on Cold War when I first played it. Um, have been playing it, like, on and off for the past few months. And it grew on me, not going to lie. Uh, so I'm, I'm in enough to admit when something is not as bad as I thought it would be. And yeah, I'm also excited for multiplayer. Not certain about campaign. Not really much of a campaign guy. I played some of it in the past. Not really, like, nowadays, though. I haven't really played campaign since, like, Cold War, and I only played, like, three missions. Not gonna lie. I think the last one I fully played was, like, World War II. That was a really good one. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, I do wish it was a little longer, though, because it felt a little short in my opinion i was on like veteran mode but let me see what this next gun is gonna be shiva okay guess we're going back to this gun uh not exactly thrilled about it but we'll take it i'm gonna hit the launch pad here and then kind of just save up some points to get the power turned on but yeah overall those are like my main likes and dislikes like before the game comes out so i kind of want to know what you guys are like kind of excited for not so excited for uh, just, yeah, want to know your thoughts, opinions, doesn't have to be zombies, can be multiplayer, campaign, whatever, you know? But yeah, besides Call of Duty Black Ops 6, I do have a lot of things coming up this next month. Uh, number one, I'm going to be going up out of state for a wedding, so that's going to be pretty fun. Uh, that'll be like October 30th to November 3rd. So I'll try to record a lot of videos between there for like those days, but I can't promise too much for that. Uh, number two, I will be hopefully uh, closing on a house on the 7th and moving in on the 9th of November. But, uh, like, fully moved in, but we'll see. Not entirely certain how that will go, because it could be delayed or things can't happen. Don't want to jinx it, but knock on wood, you know? And then I will have to do another trip out of state to grab something, uh, so that way we can have it for the house. So that will be also fun, but that will be, like, 
not the weekend after, but the weekend weekend after that. I think like the 15th or something like that. I can't. No, not the 15th. Maybe the 15th. I don't know. I have to recheck my schedule. But yeah, busy, busy, busy. Lots of stuff to do. What do we got? The Gorgon. Not not thrilled about this gun either, but better than the Shiva. And it is a Hellhound round. I'm not going to fully buy the power just yet. Because of the fact that we only get 600 points from these dogs. At most, if we, like, headshot them. Now, I will say, I am not looking forward to the pans around. I know that would be a stressful round if we don't get something good. I'm praying we'll get, like, the ray gun or the XM-53. I'm not gonna lie. But we could really, we could really get anything. Alright, show us what the next gun's gonna be. The Pharaoh. Alright, that is good for points. Not gonna lie. I'm not gonna complain that much, actually. Because it's a really good point gun. And as long as we kind of like keep a little bit of distance, we should be fine. I will say I am a little upset that we are not going to be able to do like customizable emblems. However, I do know why. I mean, some of y'all, I mean, I can't, I can't really speak on just y'all. I, I was included in some of that stuff. But some of y'all had some real messed up stuff. But I will say it was real funny seeing some of that stuff. Because I remember some of them being... Kind of generic, you know, Stewie Griffin, uh, Pikachu, Pokemon, that sort of stuff. And then it's like a dolphin that's like naked, like a naked woman dolphin thing. And that was really funny. Or like the uh, toilet paper one where it's like, they see me rolling. Ah, good old days. Good old days. All right. We got another round. Got to get a new gun. And yeah, I should probably hit the power here soon. Uh, after I get a new gun, hopefully the, uh, box doesn't move. I think it will, either this round or next, uh, it will move, so please don't move, please don't move, please be good. Ooh, Dracon, have not used you in a while. Alright, let's throw on the power, get Jug as soon as possible, and probably get a shield, cover my back, you know. Gonna turn on this launch pad, and is it down here? No, over here then. You know, it's really weird that the, uh, trap here duplicates the zombies like it doesn't officially kill them and it's never been patched out and i am mainly saying that because i remember like a lot of people beating the easter egg for this map on round four and it's like wow you have to do a lot of like time and patience for it because of the fact that like you kill too many zombies or you don't have enough points that's it your run is over i've never tried it myself nor do i plan to because i know i would not have the patience for it I can be patient for some, uh, patient for some things, but that is definitely not one of them. Uh, let me hit the mess, not mystery box, uh, back a punch machine. Man, my brain is just, whew, gone. All right, I think that is the last zombie. I'm gonna try to more so focus on the, uh, pyramid here. Probably should have saved two zombies. Oh, well. Come on, come on, come, come on. There we go. Whew. Yeah. Make sure he does not kill me. I know they can swing like a motherfucker. All right, let's see if I remember where all these shield pieces are. I know there's a chance for... Yeah, there he is. I was about to say, no, there's a chance for one to be up here, one right there, and then one on the little, like... I don't know what to call that. Metal decoration thing? I don't know. Something like that. All right, let's end the round, get a new gun, and... Well, just keep on going. Oh, yeah, normally I try to go for a goal for, like, a high round I want to go for. I want to go for at least round 20. Normally, ooh, beautiful gun right there. But, uh, yeah, I think round 20 would be a nice round. Uh, normally I go with, like, 15, but I want to want to shoot a little higher here. You know what? No, 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 no. 25. Let's shoot straight to the moon. Now, let's see. What other two perks should I get? Probably speed and i'm thinking double tap i know i could try to go for uh widow's wine but it would be way too risky with how rare you uh you have to get or how rare it is to get out of the wonder fist machine ah there it goes the round little ray gun is over let's see what our final gun is the pharaoh of course it is of course all right now would probably be a good time to get double tap gonna need to save up just a little bit more but i at least want to be in the area where it is so that way i don't have to like wait too much longer all right let me buy that and then we do have a death machine uh i want to get some more points first and then we'll pick it up Ooh, we got a nuke instead i will take that and just kind of sprint all the way to the box all right let us hit the mystery box see what our luck one tell us today like i said i think it will be the teddy bear oh surprisingly not vmp hmm 
Have not used this gun in a while as well. Pretty solid gun as well, though. By the way, I might be doing some, like, more multiplayer and campaign content when it comes out. I'm not too set on the campaign part, but I do want to do multiplayer, at least, like, alongside the zombies. So that way there's, like, more so a variety of stuff. Because I don't want to just do zombies. Don't get me wrong. I love zombies, but sometimes sometimes we need more so a variety of things all right round 12 pans around we're hitting a box please be good please be good please be good and teddy bear knew it all right uh we're gonna buy speed cooler we're gonna see where the box ends up try not to die uh and yeah just gotta do our best here and there he is how you doing, Panzer? You doing good? You gonna shoot me? Yep. All right. Where's the box? I'm not seeing it so far. Ah, oh, it's over there at the uh, rocket. Okay. Not the worst, not the best, but we're gonna have to make our way down there quick. All right. Making our way to the mystery box. Let's see what we get. I know the Panzer will be here in like two seconds. Oh my God. You guys got here in two seconds. Oh, we gotta book it. No, 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 just a little bit. Okay, that's a bit weird. The Panzer is not here yet. Normally, there he is. Okay. <laughs> I was about to say, normally he's supposed to be here, but I uh, guess he wanted to take his time here. Uh, thankfully, we got the Drak on, so we can just easily kill him like that. Just beautiful chef's kiss. Anyway, new round, new weapon. Please be good. Pretty please. Pretty please. Okay, SVG, not, not a good gun. I'll take it, though. Kind of have to. Oh, I just remembered another thing I am super excited for for Black Ops 6. is the fact that Kevin Sherwood is coming back to make some more uh, music for zombies. Oh, I cannot wait. I love the songs he makes. Ooh, we got Fire Sale. Uh, not exactly going to be useful, but I'll take it. Well, it might be useful if we uh, finish the round beforehand. All right. New gun. What are we going to get? Hopefully, I'm going to say the dredge. Let's see. Oh, my God. <laughs> I did not think that would work. Man, I need to do that more often. I'll just say ray gun every single time. Nah, probably not. The ray gun will be way too useless on the lower rounds as far as, like, points go. You know, I'm not gonna lie. I have a small feeling that this next gun we're gonna get is not gonna be really good. I don't know. Just a small feeling. Oh, never mind. Never mind. That is a beautiful gun. Never mind. I, I take back what I said. When's the next pans around? Is it next round or round 17? Because I don't think it's this round. I do believe it should be round 17. And then it follows like traditional origin standards of like every three to four rounds. I can't remember. I'm going to grab that. Head back inside because the rocket is about to go off. All right. Mystery box. Please be good. Please be good. Gorgon. Okay. I knew our luck would run out eventually. Ah, ha, ha. of course you come, and the gun I get is a pharaoh. That, that's mean. That's not, that's not nice. All right, is Pack-a-Punch still here? It is. I'm gonna use all the bullets that I can, and then try to kill him with the uh, Pack-a-Punch weapon, because I'm not gonna be able to do too much with this, uh, with this gun one way or another. You know, I would really kill for some insta-kill right now. Okay, that's... Oh, wow. Okay, I'm gonna just run. I'm not gonna worry so much about trying to let... Uh, or not let, but like kill these zombies. I'm gonna try to run away. I think this action would be pretty good. Ooh, that was a risk. That was a risk. That was a risk. Woo! Okay, he's shooting stuff. All right, fly like an eagle. And then we gotta get quick revive and pretty much all our perks back. Oh, God, we only got four bullets as well. That's... Woo, get, okay, okay. We got two perks, two perks. Now we just need to get a shield. All right. We should be a lot better now. Still got to be very careful, though. Speed cool is right here. And it's just a little short trip to double tap. And we have all our perks. And then we should probably launch our way back. Uh, you know what? You know what? Ah, uh, what should we do? What should we do? I'm going to pack a punch first. Pack a punch first. Double tap second. Because we can always get double tap on the way through. Pack a punch would be a lot better right now. Even though it wouldn't really... Help too much with the Pharaoh. Oh, at least help a little bit here. All right, there we go. We got the uh, full set of weaponry and perks. So we should be a little bit better now. All right, come on. We got to get a lot of bullets in this guy. Ah, oh, he takes a little more. He needs to take a little more. He's almost there. He's almost there. There we go. Whew. The Pharaoh actually killed him. Oh, and we got some nukes. Got a carpenter. We're good. We're good. Uh, let us go and get out of here once more, because we do gotta hit the box. Oh, no. We got a rocket test fire. Okay, uh, gotta get out of here. Definitely not staying down here. 
I can't exactly use this weapon or else that would be breaking the rules. All right. Now we can hit the mystery box. Oh, we got the hellhound here as well. Crap, that's not good. No bueno, no bueno. Grab the weapon. Okay, weevil. I'll take it. You know, it feels a little legal pack-a-punching a gun just to kill like five zombies and then training it away shortly after. But uh, here we are. Pretty much doing that. All right, box. Give me something good. Please, pretty please. And we got XM53. You know what? It's a uh, Hellhound round. I will take that. I'm not going to complain, actually. Actually, I would not complain if it was like a normal round as well. Because I'm not that bad of a shot with the XM53. I actually really like it. I've gotten used to like explosive weaponry. So I don't really need to worry too much about like, oh no. I gotta make sure I don't die with it, you know? Alright, please don't give me the bear. Please, okay. Whew, was a little worried there. It was going to give me the bear with the uh, rocket here. All right, we should be on another box move here soon. Probably this round. Let me see. Yep, knew it. All right, uh, right, let's find out where the next location will be. I'm assuming near the double tap area. Not too certain where, but more so on that side of the uh, side of the castle here. Ha <laughs> ha, I caught it. I got it. All right, we got to be very careful here because we got we got some zombies trying to trying to get us a little bit here. What do we got there? Uh, dredge? Dredge. No, not again. Ah, uh, that's unfortunate. Um, I'm going to go downstairs. Downstairs seem to be a better option here. At least compared to, like, that horde of zombies over there. Ooh, we're gonna need to get a brand new shield here as well. Uh, just gonna focus on the perks first, and then we'll go for a shield. Oh, no, this is not good. That's not good. Why? Why? Oh, this is not good. Ooh, okay. Okay, we're gonna be fine. We're gonna be fine. We got one more quick revive I think we can do. No, we don't. We kind of used it all. You know, I'm not gonna lie. I remember when they had, like, Zombies Chronicles released, and they had that, like, whole entire month of, like, double liquid divinium or something like that and i just remember grinding it out on uh what map was it uh Verruckt. i remember doing it on Verruckt because there was like a specific way you can do it where it's just very fast round seven instant uh liquid divinium basically but man oh man we are definitely not on a good time right now because we just ran out of all our quick revise um we should be able to get double tap here soon uh once we go up here uh, or wait, we could've- we could've went up the stairs. Never mind, why did I go through here? Whatever. We're just gonna go the long way, I guess. And then I think I'm gonna try to hit for Widow's Wine a little bit here and there. Uh, can't promise if I'll get it or not, though. But one double tap later. And we are now back to a full one-man army here. We also got Fire Sail for the next round here, so let's try to end off this round as soon as possible, please. There we go. Now we can hit the box and get a brand new gun. Please be good. Please be good. Please be good. And it is the Dango. Yes, that is a beautiful gun. Of course, the Panzer is coming. I'm going to go, uh, like I said, hit the one of this machine. Hope for the best. I uh, can't promise much, though, sadly. Uh, let's see. Please be good. Please be good. Please be good. I need to, like, double one turn back into the uh, Panzer there. What do we got? Looks like You know what? I'll take it. Come on, die. You took, like... Pretty much a good mag there. Come on, you're almost there. Almost there. There we go. Woo. Took a little second, a little while there. This is not a good area for me to be in. Gonna try to just go through these zombies. Just kind of powerhouse through it. Ah, uh, that's not worth to go up there. Gonna go downstairs. All right, we are almost to round 25. I'm actually kind of nervous that we're not gonna make it there. Uh, please give me something good to make it through the rest of these rounds. XM53, you know what? Like I said... I can take this. I can take this. Never mind. I cannot take this. Ooh, huh, oh, what? Yeah, there we go. Oh, that was a uh, that was stressful. I will need to pack a punch this here soon, but I'm gonna focus more so on using most of the ammo here. Gonna need a new shield, however. So let me go quickly do that. Where is pack a punch anyway? Uh, I think that said upstairs area. I couldn't really read it that fast. All right, new shield, and it is the. Uh, the anti-graph, which is perfect, because we can just squeeze through all these zombinos. Yeah, there's the pack-a-punch. Let me put my gun in ya, and then grab it out once more again. You know, it'd be really crazy if you could, like, double pack-a-punch the, uh, explosive and water weapons. I know there was, like, a glitch when Chronicles first came out, 
but that has been like long patched. All right, let us move off this gun, see what our next gun's gonna be. And then we should make it to round 25, depending on, you know, the choice of weaponry here. But let us see, let us see, we are gonna get the BRM. All right, pretty good. Yes, there you go, round 25, we have done it. Uh, let's see how much further we can continue. I'm not gonna promise anything on how far we'll make it, especially with that, wow. Yeah, I think this might be the end for us. I really wish that we had a Hellhound round this round. Yeah, this is not good. I'm pretty much using, like, a whole entire mag just to kill, like, one or maybe even two zombies here. Please, still be up here back a bunch. Ah. All right, where did you go to? You're at the Undercraft. Okay, uh, that's not that bad. I was really hoping it was not going to be at the uh, Rocket Station because I do not like... Do not like being down there, personally. Woo! We are not in a good pickle. Definitely not in a good one. It's all rotten and sour. Oh, Jesus Christ. Where did you all come from? Ugh, I'm gonna have to hit the tram. I'm gonna have to hit the tram. Please give me something good. Max ammo. Insta-kill. I'll even take a nuke. Like, please, anything good. All right, what do we got? What do we got? Insta-kill. Yes, that's what I actually need. Oh, that'll make things a lot easier here, because I did not want to, uh, did not want to actually try to survive with just, like, a max ammo or a nuke. Insta-kill, though, that would, that, that cleared up everything. Like, bam, done. I think the Panzer's coming next round, if I'm not mistaken. Trip mines, damn it. Alright, do over. Please, nothing kill me, nothing kill me, nothing kill me, nothing kill me, nothing kill me. What is that? I cannot tell. Dracon? I'll take it. I will take the Dracon. You know, I will be honest, I might run out of ammo before I'll, like, complete a single round here soon. Because we are just, we are running out of ammo like crazy. And then just having to rely on some guns, like the Pharaoh, that would not be reliable if we don't get, like, insta-kill or max ammos. And I'm gonna be honest, that's kind of like a drop of a hat right there, where it's like, I have to book for it if that happens. Because it's really rare to get a uh, max ammo or insta-kill for now. But, like, it takes a lot of bullets for, like, the non-pack-a-punch guns, and that's just... I need to first prioritize non-pack-a-punch before I pack-a-punch it, because I'll run out of ammo that way. I just, I'm just gonna run out of ammo. Okay, we do got max ammo. That is beautiful. I'm gonna try to just kind of save that just for a couple seconds here. I'm gonna try to just more so focus on the zombies. Okay, a little too close there. All right, now I'll grab it because I am, I'm gonna be losing that if I don't grab it now. Another one. See, you know what? I just need to start complaining more and I will have stuff work in my favor. All right, let's see what this gun's gonna be. Probably gonna be something like a teddy bear. Nope, perfect. Okay, uh, we gotta run. Hi, Panzer. I'm gonna be going this direction. Uh, you don't need to follow me. You can just go away. Man, I am thankful they do not have their grappling hooks on this map. Because that would be way, way too annoying. Uh, they probably don't have it, though. Because it probably would have, like, broken some areas of the map. Uh, kind of more so like the, what do you say, the final boss room area. I mean, it broke some things in Origins when Chronicles came out. And it's still kind of broken, but they fixed it somewhat. Because a lot of people kept on having a glitch where it's like, they killed the Panzer at the last second when they get grabbed. And they're just stuck like sideways, they can't move. Ooh, this might be our downfall here soon. Gonna need to go and pack a punch as well. Oh no, this is the end. That's, uh, <laughs> I got stuck. I thought I could make it, but nope. But that was pretty good. Round 28. Wow, a lot further than uh, what I thought it was going to be. I'm not complaining whatsoever. But uh, yeah, I think that'll end it all for this episode. If you, got, uh, you guys got any challenges, please recommend it down in the comment section below. Or just anything else, just throw it out there. Games, content ideas, that sort of stuff. And yeah, if you guys still like the video, please like, comment, subscribe. This has been Luther20, signing out. Bye-bye.